Hello! This video series trains users on FreeQMS's Divisions system. Divisions is an enterprise record management tool intended for companies with more than one physical location or business unit. For example, a single company that produces medical devices in one location and pharmaceuticals in another. If your company operates a single location with a single business purpose, it's unlikely divisions need to be configured. This series covers the following topics. FreeQMS Divisions Explained FreeQMS records with a single division. Add a second division. Grant access to a second division. Create a record in a second division. Move a record to the FreeQMS global division. Please be advised, record divisions are a powerful feature with the ability to create electronic walls between company records. Divisions should not be implemented without planning and careful thought. Let's start by giving an overview of divisions. Click the divisions icon. All FreeQMS instances start with two divisions, the global division and a default division. Let's take a moment to explain divisions. An electronic division is like a physical filing room with its own key. All of your electronic records go in one room with a locked door. Your employees in this case need to have a username and a password to open the door. But what if your company has two separate filing rooms? They may store everything for their medical device division in one room and everything for their pharmaceutical division in another. This is the same company with separate divisions. FreeQMS is even used by global conglomerate companies with 10 or even 20 divisions. This means many electronic filing rooms. They don't want everyone from one division to be able to see the others. So why not just make more than one FreeQMS account? Why not put your users from different company divisions in different instances? Inevitably, large companies have people in management or quality assurance that need insight into each division's records. It's important to note that a company might have a largely separate quality management system for each division, but that doesn't mean all aspects of the quality management system are separate. For example, a large company may have a global harassment training. All users should receive this training. Training records should go in global division, represented here by the globe. All users have access to this division. On the other hand, our first business unit, medical device, has its own supplier records and procedure. These records should go in a division called medical device, and users at this site should be given access. Our second business unit, pharmaceutical, has separate supplier records and procedures, and is audited to different standards. These records should go in a division called pharmaceutical, and users at this site should be given access. Confused yet? Don't be. Let's look at some real examples of divisions.